welcome to my channel this is going to be a reading for my libras let's see what the next 72 hours has in store for you any information you may be looking for will be in the description if you do want a personal reading with me i'm back to taking my uh or taking personal reading session so if you would like to get a reading you can it's gonna be below and subscribe hit the notification bell so you never miss me first car we have Libras we have the seven of swords representing just the general energy so you are purposely trying to stay away from a person certain habits uh certain distractions you are intentionally trying to be tactful around what you're giving your energy to during this time frame ow hurt my hand you could be realizing that someone is just deceitful and it just is what it's going to be there's nothing that you can necessarily do to get this person to be let's say a lot more honest or truthful about things and you're just letting it be uh, also with the seven of swords it talks about hmm addressing things that maybe you put off to the side if you've been putting your art to the side putting a business to the side like kind of neglecting yourself or certain aspects of your goals the things that you need in order for you to be you you could also be paying attention to that now going into career and finance i have the king of wands so there could be a fire sign of significance around your career this could be somebody giving you an opportunity somebody at work of significance okay this could also just speak to you having this sense of fire return if you were just losing your sense of motivation or your ability to stay driven as a whole i think that this time frame is going to push you into this like sense of motivation again to get back to why you wanted to do certain things career-wise why you wanted to achieve certain things within your career hmm i see also some of my Libra's going for like a higher position. You could be feeling like, you know what? I should be a manager somewhere. I should be an entrepreneur or a boss to some degree. And looking at ways that you can kind of position yourself for that as well. Now, when it comes to love, I have the judgment. So judgment talks about rethinking things, reconciliations okay certain issues from the past being brought back up within a relationship so next 72 hours if there has been certain issues within your connection that haven't actually been fully addressed or put to bed there's going to be a time frame where that's going to be a focus <laughs> There also could be someone trying to get back on your good graces. This is somebody who you just temporarily took a break from. You guys may have been separated for like a couple days, couple weeks. And with them resurfacing, it becomes this question of, can I trust them? Uh, is this in my best interest to let this person back into my life? Is this gonna go left? Okay, you also could be rethinking things when it comes to someone you're dealing with. You could be questioning like, hmm, is this somebody who I do want to actually take serious, you know? Especially if they have a challenge with getting over their ex. I almost kicked my water over. Now, the possible challenge, I have the Six of Wands. So the challenge could be someone really wanting a level of attention from you and then like going out of their way to, to get this attention okay the challenge could also be you wanting to be successful wanting to you know accomplish certain things but maybe not knowing the exact steps to get there and being intimidated by it even though you, you never really know the full steps to get to where you're trying to go you just kind of wing it as you as you go and the challenge is understanding that like you're not perfect you're going to make mistakes along the way the more mistakes the better so that you can learn what not to do hmm. the challenge could also be a version of self that someone's showing you that they didn't show you before and it's making you look at them a little bit differently like 
mm, you didn't show me this side where you get really, really rambunctious whenever you're, you're mad or you insult whenever you're upset. Now, advice out of the three of wands. So the advice is to consider the long term in anything that you do, any decisions you make or any moves that you make during this time frame, pretty much beyond this time frame too, but especially during this window of time where you're considering, okay, if I do X, Y, and Z, where is this gonna take me down the line? Because a lot of times we could have a clear goal of, you know, I want to be successful in the future, but in the current day, we're not making the best decisions with our finances. Or I know I want to be married someday, but then currently entertaining situations that don't align with marriage or don't align with what you value. Now, last card is going to represent the outcome and I have the seven of cups. So the outcome, you could have a bit of emotional confusion because you could be torn. Emotionally, you feel unsure about a person, unsure about what your options may be career-wise. Should I do this? Should I do that? Should I be trying to do multiple things at once? What's going to make sense for me? Am I on the right path currently? These are the types of questions you could be asking. You also could be getting mixed signals emotionally from someone else that you're dating and dealing with where it's just leaving you lost. Like, what's going on? Are we on the same page or what? Uh, am I delusional in the way that I feel about this connection? Or is this genuinely something that, you know, we can capitalize off of, something that we can grow in? Hmm. You also could be wondering, is somebody like throwing up smoke screens, making things seem one way when it's really not? I just keep getting that. It's like you're trying to see beyond just the illusion of what's being presented on the surface with someone when they could be a lot more depth behind, you know, what they have going on that they're not really showing you. But as a whole, this is what I see. I hope that this did give you insight for the next 72 hours. If you did enjoy, definitely thumbs up the video and subscribe so you never miss a beat. Uh, leave a comment as well. I will leave the information below if you want a question and thank you for your support as always. I appreciate you guys. Bye.